Shifting gears here, more twists and turns mm. tonight in the Vikings search for a new head coach. Yeah, a big name in town today to sit down with the team. Our Don Mitchell joins us live from outside of team headquarters. And Don, we got breaking news here coming down from Michigan coach Jim Harbaugh here within the past couple of moments. What is it? You know, you're absolutely right, Tim. In the past hour, of course, Adam Schefter breaking the news, saying that he is indeed going back to Michigan. Fox 9 can independently confirm that, yes, Jim Harbaugh will not be the next head coach of the Vikings. He was here this morning as early as 7.15 in the morning, and we're going to go to some, some footage. We were here first thing in the morning. We did not see him get into the building, but this indeed was the vehicle that he arrived in. So, yes, he was here in Minnesota. He did meet with Vikings brass for quite some time, but as to when he left the building, he did not leave out the same exit that we were here. So he must have gone out another door, many exits around TCO Performance Center. But however, we can tell you that he is no longer here at the facility, has gone back to his hotel, and will be going back to Michigan. So it's been a kind of a crazy day, to be honest with you. What went down, we have to wait and see. There are sources out there now projecting who will indeed will be the next head coach, who they're targeting. We'll have to look further detail into that in the next coming days. Some say we'll have to wait until the Rams are out of the Super Bowl so we can see who indeed will be the Vikings next head coach. But what we do know for now, all of that is speculation, is that Jim Harbaugh will not. He will be returning to Michigan to coach the Wolverines once more. So it's been an interesting ride out here, but due diligence is what the Vikings are doing. So now they move on as the field gets narrower and narrower. But as of now, they do not have a head coach. Back to you. All right, Don, thank you. Don Mitchell, she's on top of it.